Hi, Hi Roisin. Hi, Peter. Hi, Peter. Hey, guys. How's it going? Good. Did, did someone have a homemade haircut there, Peter? Do you, do you like that one? By order of the Peaky Blinders. <laughs> <laughs> the, the wife and the kids got the, uh, got the razor out and went, went to town. So really? it wasn't a ball job. It was the it was the uh, the frying pan on the head this time. Just did Sharon do it? She did, yeah, yeah. yeah Sharon and the kids yesterday. I came down the other, about two weeks ago to find to find uh, all, all the boys had shaved each other's heads at five o'clock <laughs> after well, a Zoom a Zoom birthday party. I was like different people in the house. Well, you're looking looking gorgeous as always, Roisin. Very dolled up for the day. Thank you very much. This is my runners on here underneath. So <laughs> like, I forgot I was doing this and thought I better get in to do this. And just put the shirt on. This is a like we could do everything like this, Peter. Where I'm just giving you instructions down to go and do this. No, on on site is enough. We're starting now. We're starting. Oh, here we go. Wonderful every day. I love that. that yeah. One. In the pop up every All around week. the country are families who've fallen out of love with their homes. It's a disaster. It really is a disaster. Does it feel like a distant memory already, lads? Yes. Uh, what was that? last summer, wasn't it? Yeah. But I, I loved um, what we did in that house. I can do that with our honeymoon period of, of series three because we were really, like, it was really hard. But we were doing. I loved the staircase and the light well. Like I really. A honeymoon period. A honeymoon period where Peter actually said, "Keep watching." I had a different honeymoon than you did, then I can tell you that. <laughs> you did a good job. Yeah, I know honeymoon. It's home rescue. Well, here we go. Yeah. Here we go. Just outside the pretty town of Adair, County Limerick. It's a gorgeous village. Oh, what a town. Stunning, isn't it? What a town. What were your first impressions, Roisin, of this house? I loved this house because it was so um, colourful, actually. You know, the way the Irish people don't like to put a lot of colour into their houses, and I know, like, I knew even walking in there it was going to be a really tough job because I thought she was very artistic, she was a good eye, but a very small house, tiny house. Like, it struck me how small it was. The bathroom was nearly the biggest room in the house, which says the most spaces, so it was a tough one. And I knew it was going to be tough to do anything that was going to make a big difference because she's the kind of woman who could, have just, who could have just, she didn't need anybody to do colour to do, you know what I mean? Yeah, she had loads of colours already done. She had loads of lovely little arts and crafts stuff done yeah. as well, hadn't she? No, really no. nice, but look at the clutter though. Was, the house was just so small. And then when you bring clothes and just everyday yeah. life into a house, it, get, it made a small house much smaller, didn't it? Tiny well. And I remember we went down the first time and measured it. And then, you know, when that place is usually cleared out, I thought I had a full panic there now. Look at that room because I realized the distance between, you know, the screen of that staircase and the yeah. breath you could reach with two hands. It was tiny. And my hands, like, and I'm a smallie, like, you could, it was tiny. And the chimney stuck in the middle of the house. Yeah, that's it. It's the old traditional. Yeah. The, the, the chimney was obviously the heating system in the house back the years ago, you know, and uh, it was an essential part of the building. But there, you can see it there. It just took up so much space in those old houses, you know. They were small as it was, and then this big, massive chimney up through the middle. That was tough that she had to go through her daughter's room. Yeah. I have to say, though, I mean, I'm up in an attic. I love an attic. I don't mind an attic. But I keep. Yeah. That aspect, it feels very with some reason, the darkness again, it was sort of that mid, that yeah. was really, that little girl's room was very oppressive. Well, they were maximizing the size of the house regime with, yeah. with what they had. And, and unfortunately, the only extra space they could gain was that with that space in the attic. And it, like, it, it really wasn't big enough for what they were doing with it, you know. And it was obvious that the work that they did was on a, a very, very tight budget. Even yeah. tighter than, than what you to give us, Jane. Believe me, they're tight budgets. You got that one, Jane, not me. <laughs> <laughs> I also think, though, one of the things that struck me about the place is that bathroom. I was like, going to lose the bathroom. I think I nearly. Like, I, 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 the other thing that disappointed me was that, like, that room was just, given that they've hardly any space. Yeah, but the, the craft room took up too much of the house, you know? Like, yeah, it, it, obviously, craft and that type of stuff was a, a, a big part of their lives, but. You see, was, see that? 
Yeah, yeah. I love that. Did that stay? That what? Did that stay or go? No, it was gone. I was, I was like, oh, and she was, I was like, where, where was that? I still think about those wings. I thought they were cute. That was a, that was a full of things. That's the room. Yeah, look how dark it is off to as well. It's a disaster. It really is a disaster. There is no comfort in that for me. But I do love all my materials. I love to repeat them. Oh, here she comes. Oh, look at her. Do, 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 do. <laughs> I hate these stuff. I'm always like kind of going, this is great. Well, let's look at yourself. You know, you could do it a good bit of Botox after you clean those dots now. You'd be like, injected yourself to go to breathing. No, at, at the same extent, I love the, uh, over a good chunk I know, it is exciting. When you get here on this day, it's always exciting to be right. I love this day because you're kind of full of, we can do it and there isn't the reality coming down. There's the clutter busters, hard yeah. of action. Yeah. They're great. There's Kim. Couldn't do it without you. Huh? Do without them. No, I tell you, fair play to them. They really do. Okay. Some of the big part. They, they basically create the canvas that we can work on, don't they, Roshan? You know. Hard throwing. <laughs> there comes the boss now. Look. There she is. An Adam. That room was really good. Not much work happens in a couple of hours. Yeah, I, I. And then somebody was saying to me recently, oh, uh, that this is a great time to declutter, right? And I said, actually, it's not, because there's so much work goes into this game of how you take the stuff out and how you put it and the space to do it. Like, and, like it really is an extraordinary feat that gets done every time. And that just helps also learn. Look at the amount of stuff there. Oh my God. There's Leah. So nice stylish jacket there. Yeah, and her glasses are great too. That's her pal. <laughs> no social distancing happening there. No, no back in the good old days. There's some advantages to social distancing though. Me and Roshan, you might have to stay far enough away that I can't hear you anymore. <laughs> I know, but you hear about the robots are coming to into doctor surgeries. I'll cook it on the set of wheels. Yeah. A Roshan robot. Oh my god. I think that this was terrifying. Oh, look at, look at the woman in action. Look. look at that. But look how tiny that room is, Peter. Like I think yeah. that was the and look how much I look at that cabinet as well, though. You you debated this a lot, didn't you? The change of rooms. Well you see I I, I I meant I, when I was talking to them, when we were there, I just, when she had moved downstairs, it, I suddenly realised we were dealing with a different home. That, you know when you come in, I mean, sometimes you get it right, sometimes you get it wrong. But the fact that Leah had moved downstairs, I just thought, oh, so the, the, the whole dynam dynamic had changed. And she was a teenager, so I don't know. It did change things up a bit, though. There, there's His Highness. <laughs> His Highness, <laughs> or like a servant, or like a servant and a prince. I, I am going to remind you of that when you're when you're ordering around the place. That you're my servant. <laughs> I'm ordering you around. You said it yourself. I, you, I, you're my. I think. I think. Servant. I think quarantine has affected your memory, Roshan. <laughs> I, I asked. I asked my kids who was the boss on the site, and they all treat him. Roshan. I like that. Your girls are obviously very well aware. <laughs> you know how Sharon goes. Girl power. Uh, this was a tough one though, but we thought, I think that this, we knew exactly what we were doing on this one. You know, the details and stuff. I thought that was great. Sorry, did you say that you knew exactly what you were doing on this one? That's exactly what I was doing here. Oh, we'll see what happens now in two seconds. I, I only walk in the door and wait till you see what happens. What happens? I forget, I have Well, you watch, watch, watch and see. Oh, no. <laughs> I'm having a you have better memory feature than Roshin. Yeah. I remember it well, because I, I literally walk in the door yeah. and you say, remember we were going to do this? Well, it's changed and we're going to yeah. do yeah. this. I don't know. That doesn't use. <laughs> it usually happens after. You usually give me a little bit of settling in time. Not down here. It was like, no. remember no. everything that we discussed? Forget Never. that. Let's, no let's go for plan, plan B, and plan then it went to plan C, plan D. How many plans in total? One. My plan. 
<laughs> and it works, Shane. And actually, do you want to know something terrible? I can't tell you, actually. Here, Here we go. Now, listen, listen to this. Listen. I'm all motivated, Roshan. I'm ready to go. All right, okay. Now to put that commendable optimism and energy to the test. We're doing a few little changes, as always. Right, we're... So we're just six, seven, eight seconds of changing. Okay. Right, okay. okay. Do you remember we were putting the wall down here in a little bench seat? There you go. Okay. No, it's not happening. That's not happening. No, that's no, not happening. This is happening instead. Much better idea. Do you remember, that, do, do you remember that little wall that we were going to do? Instead of that, we're going to put a hole in the roof. Yeah. Little change. <laughs> When, when do you find this out, Peter? Uh, need to know basically. Right there, right that moment. I can't, there are some things like are better, you know, you need to know basis, isn't that it? Like you don't yeah. push people yeah. into the dilemma that well, they have like, to encounter. And, and what I yeah, love like about this, what I love about this is Keep. the way the hole got bigger and bigger. Like that it was like, why <laughs> said to you? I said to you at the very beginning, I want you to put a double height well, into a cottage within two days in a sky like you. <sighs> Absolutely not, Roti. Absolutely too too much, Roti. This is just too much. Yeah, it's 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 how you present it, Jack. Just yeah. keep, treat me like a mushroom, keep me in the dark, and feed me full yeah, of. Yeah, I know. But by episode, <laughs> by episode three, you're fit to kill me. Just as well. Just fair enough. Oh, I love that. Oh. Yeah, but I like that. I am okay with that wall as it stands. <laughs> oh, I'm dead. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, well, it has a certain, like, it has that thing you can't get in a modern building. Like an earthquake field one? <laughs> it also has a funny smell, this room. <laughs> Why did you like that wall so much? Why did I like that wall so much? That wall was one of those... It was that things. rustic look, wasn't it? Well, you couldn't cover it up, right? If you were going to cover it up, it was going to fall yeah. off again. You couldn't... You could do yeah. what you could do, but if you cover up the problem, you're le it's like that thing with bad workmanship. So my feeling was we'd make it work and then they'd be able to keep an eye on whether or not, you know, how that damp worked. And whether, if we solved the problem, great. In a year's time, we can get it plastered. But if we covered it up, it was just one row mold. And yeah, well, we... When I went we, back, we decided on the ventilation for that one, didn't yeah, we? Yeah, yeah. And it did work because... Um, yeah. Oh, yeah. Yeah, they, they, her mold smell had gone, actually. But it, we did... It was a tough one. There was a lot of problems because when the insulation was put on, they covered up the vent. Yeah. yeah. Streamlines, everything is happening. You stop to say streamline. <laughs> oh! <laughs> But that was it for the wood liners, Peter. That wall, there used to be a door in that wall as well. If I'd been given an extra day, you'd have been doing, I think it'd have been even worse. <laughs> I always think that when everybody's saying, do we get an extra day? I'm kind of going, it could be worse for Peter if we ever get extra time to do this series. <laughs> they put me in an early grave. Yeah. yeah I know, it, like, it, it that that that's the the end of the four well it's not even the end of the first day it's it's when we've kind of got the remit and i'm all okay great let's do it but then you get a moment of realization where you go i know actually get this done yeah. and, and then and you, you you know what i'm like i'm going wait listen stop talking let me start working you, start hate, working. Me. you hate me on day at the end of day two no, I, I don't um, hate is a very strong word what's the word that would you best describe it then fit to kill <laughs> 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 no, it's uh, what's what's the best way to describe it? It's uh, let's let's just say we're we're probably on different levels at that that point oh, yeah. in the time, you know. Oh, the uh, we have to balance our our, our emotions up. Yeah. I, well, I I just said it there. Like I'm I I'm at the point where I'm going. Like I agree to do certain things, and I know you've always got a few little tricks up your sleeve somewhere. And I'm saying, can I genuinely actually get this done or not? Because time it's, it just evaporates on those jobs. You know what it's like, Roshan? Like, I mean, you just, uh, it flies by. I know, it does fly and, by. And How do you measure that, Peter? I met the <laughs> With an abacus. <laughs> I, go, I, go, I go, yeah, she measures it for me. Like, I, go, I go back to wherever we're staying that night and I, I, I lie in the bed and, and I'm working out what we have to get done the next day. I'm going, oh my God. Yeah. Can I, this actually happen? I think And then I come in and I ha have to hope that you are happy with what I've done the previous day. And that's the scariest bit. I'm not messing with you. It's like it's like waiting for the schoolmaster no. to come in and look at your homework. And the worst bit is, you know, I tell myself every time I'm going in there, I am not 
going to fixate on some stupid little thing because I know how hard you're working. And I, I say outside the room, I'm there like, don't say it, don't say it. Whatever it is, just say, lovely. This is so great. And every time I walk <laughs> in and go, I, and I can hear myself going, I, 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 like trying to, it's unreal. This, <laughs> when you walk in and there's silence, that's when I get really scared. You walk in and you stop and you start looking and then your hand will come up and you kind of go, Mm. And I'm just going, oh, I know. no, here we go. And then the next word is crucial, because if you say, I like it, we're happy days. And if you say, why did that happen like that? I'm just like, oh, here we go. And that's that's genuinely what's going through my head when all this is happening, you know. But I, you see, the funny thing is, scary stuff. Stuff. yeah, it is scary stuff. And I suppose I'm always thinking, I do think about the time and about trying to make the biggest impact in the shortest time for what, for, yeah. for what we can do. There's no point in getting you there, I think. And I've always said, there's no point in having you standing there just putting bits of furniture together, flat pack. That's, for me, yeah, exactly, the way yeah. your skills, yeah. when you could get you to do holes in the wall, <laughs> holes in the floor, yeah. which is the yeah. hard thing. That, that basically, three weeks work done in three days. Yeah. So well, some, I, some, of, some, of the, some of the jobs that we've done, I, I think back in them. And yeah. when, when I watched one of the shows, can the I first show this year Peter? was Boris. Peter, can yeah. I help you? Because I want to hear what you're saying. But um, Paul wants me to say, we'll take a short break now and we'll be back for part two. Yeah. Go for it. That is a... So this is the this is this is the part where you come in and you decide my fate for the next two days. Basically, Roshan is what's coming Indeed. up now. Yeah, I decide how I'm... where I can hide in whatever hotel we are staying in. <laughs> <laughs> oh, do you remember how at the beginning of this series you said I am not go I'm going to be clean. This is the last. <laughs> Remember that? Yeah. I was going to be Zen. Yeah. Zen. Yeah. yeah. Didn't work for long, did it? No, when I said I wasn't going to push it too far this year, I was going to just relax and enjoy the ride of, you know, proper television. Yeah. And I'm, I'm so happy that you stuck to that. Here are the lads again. This is huge, amount of I yeah. Yeah. Promotion work in the tent. Yeah, and also, it's, this was a very hard one because there was nothing you could easily say. Everything was, because she wasn't an artist as such, everything had value. So you weren't able to kind of mill through it. Everything had to be oh, this was hilarious. Oh, yeah, we, we, did, we did that last thing the day before. So, well, there was nobody there to try and hide it. And then, of course, straight away got the same. You were delighted to have you bit of news. This is the bit where I got to walk in and you got to say, I have news for you, Roshi. <laughs> this was tough. That was classic though. They thought that it was going in the kitchen. Oh. And here's the boiler suit from Linda Daly. That's basically the Are you the carpenter? I love that music. Yeah. I love that stairs. I loved the sheeting in that. I, I get messages about that stairs. Really architectural and also has a kind of vernacular feel to it. Morning, Mr. Finn. What's vernacular mean? Vernacular means no architecture, please. No. It sounds like something a vampire would do to you. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, this is where I get. This is where I get really stupid. Though. Like we've two days, but you know what we need to do? Route yeah. This is where well, you I totally you disagree with your motion. I think this is this is what makes the show. Thank you so much, Peter. I appreciate that. This when is where I'm this is where we spend twenty minutes or thirty minutes talking about tiny details. Yeah, but like and that, my head is just going, "Come on, let's get moving. Let's get moving. Let's get moving." No, I know. But then you look at it in the end, and you go. But I don't know. I don't. I think that's God. the. Image. That's the. You know. Yeah. I keep thinking that that's. I actually. Detail. I drive away from every show going. Thank you, Roshan. Thank you very much, Roshan. That's what they say after every show. <laughs> Wait, that, really? I don't. I don't. I think it's like back on the road. <laughs> and people say to me, "You're going to kill that fella, Roshan." And what are you doing, to that fella? <laughs> yeah. She's lovely color. So I'm hoping that we can do a. That would be shot. 
that she will forget to share because she's getting hitched. Are you nervous at this point? Breaking it. I am breaking it, and I think that's why I, I drive everybody nuts because I wander around with my head looking completely stressed. So it's very tough on everybody because all I'm doing is going, oh, have we made the right decision? Can this be only place in the country? Um, oh, Jim, when, yeah. when you're in the army and your leader is shown signs of, signs of stress, it's not good. You need to control your stress, okay? Because it spreads to us. That's all I'm going to say. <laughs> I think it does. I think you're right, though. I think so. This year, I'm going to oh, come does. back then. I'm going to come back then and chill and be like you have been throughout the series. Like some sort of uh, fat seven up. So I put it. <laughs> Jane, you, you no, time how long she stays in, will you please? Huh? You time yeah. it. No, I think this was very tough because we also didn't know. I just complimented her. Did you? Just complimented her. Yeah. Let me go back over that and remember said that. That it, was, it wasn't the worst idea you ever come up with. Yeah, no, it wasn't. Just compliment. Worst. It was tough. It's tough to put you all under some scratches. I won't do it again. We just do assemble, assemble furniture next year. <laughs> <laughs> I, it, it was actually, it was a really nice thing to work on. Uh, it was frustrating because I was stuck in one place for such a long time. But you could see that it was developing all the time. And the fact that it, it was so close to the stairs, it was lovely. It, 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 was, it was very satisfying working on it. I have to say that I think what we've got, the team very extraordinary. Here we go. Oh, here we go. Look. Who could it be? We had a little bit of a miscommunication on sealing the wall. So it ended up with the kind of the seal, the seal being mixed in with the paint. That I love this look. <laughs> I'd say you were really going mad here, were you? No, I didn't, because I kind of was like, oh, what can you do? You just help. But I didn't realize that, uh, is that a Brillo pads? I Brillo, so I wire rolled it down. I like, <laughs> you see, the other thing is I do like working. I like working on the side. But I didn't realize that some people were making faces that about me behind my back. I didn't realize that at all. I didn't realize. I thought, Come here. Yeah. Where do you see the next? The next bit's very interesting. Making faces at the camera. Yeah. How are we getting on with your painting? Painting everything. 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 I heard a little rumor there was a, a wall that shouldn't have been painted. It was a miscommunication. I was asked to oh. seal the wall. I sealed the wall and I painted the wall. What happened? Like, Roisin cleaned it up or...? Roisin is doing a distressed look now, let's just say. She's gonna... It will, it will <laughs> definitely be distressed. Me too! Like, you know, that was me that did that now. Can you imagine? <laughs> and that's the truth. Can you imagine if that was me? Because you know what happened, Peter? I'd be, I'd be sent home in the van. <laughs> I just, I'm just going to go present. In fairness, the charity shop did very well out of that house. I know, the charity shops are, are very good at the moment, and that's, yeah. There's my body double. I think as well, when the thing changed, that was amazing, though. Peter Finn and something like that, he's happy. He's absolutely happy, but come tomorrow, guaranteed there will be a different tone about that side. Thanks, Roger. But you do like a bit of construction work. You should be Give him a bit of timber and you'll be all right. <laughs> Final push for victory. There we go. This is tough because actually we did bar we did feel upstairs as well in the end. Do you know what I mean? Yeah. It's this is when the really kicks in where where everything has to come together. We're trying to finish the walls are still yeah. wet paint. Oh this is and you get a bit relaxed and I get a bit far more stressed here. I find this hard now. I love that. I get I get relaxed because I can see the light at the end of the tunnel. Yeah. But then you come in oh. and you start. Oh, yeah. I want to put it here. I want to put it there. No, let's take it back down again. Yeah. Oh. Yeah, and so I the half tour was a great idea. The half tour, she loves the half tour as well. I love it, and they love oh, the super idea. But the the worst thing is that then we also have Jane. We have your gang going out, out, out. Everybody yeah. out. I'm like, oh, I'm just dead. I'm gonna finish. Lights, lights. We need lights. And how is anybody gonna see this shot? But then it's true, actually, you can. She could not see the light well that we went down. It wasn't until I went down later that she, a couple of days afterwards, and she said the light well was It was the daytime thing. Mm -hmm. It had a huge effect upstairs as yeah. well as downstairs. Yeah, it, it completely changed. Uh, you know, small space is dark, it's awful. It's just depressive. There's Kim. Yeah. Yeah. It's great, isn't she? Yeah. Go, Kim. 
Are you nervous there? Oh, I'm very nervous there because she was also expecting the picture to be done. <laughs> but there was a little yeah. bit of that like kind of, oh no. Yeah. And then, you know, it, it is, you were right about the, the, the you know, the will a half or it's very hard. That's a, a living in the house thing as well. Yeah. It's not just a therapy place. It just goes, oh my God, that's amazing. She loves it. Look at the light coming in there now, Will. Yeah, it is very bright, isn't it? We're ah, so well, clever. Not lights downstairs and in the upstairs with the new lights. I, I love the ply as well on that. We were got very fond of ply this year, gee. And the burgundy radiation. Ply, yeah. I love the, the the iron oxide radiations we did this year. I like the simple skin. I, I don't get to see this until it's actually on telly, the, the reactions and how the place really looks because we're 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 gone. We're sent down the road. Jane's gonna go home, go home, go. So go, this go, part is, is yeah. always brilliant for me to watch, you know. I loved a bit of stuff. Uh, yeah. You can sit and eat here in the well. yeah. You can have the kind of dinner, yeah. open plan. Yeah, you do you don't get the praise from the homeowners at the end because you have that thing of an Irish Oh, uh, I don't I'm so tired, I don't want any praise at this stage. I just want to go home. I just want to get out of there. I have to praise it, I, I love watching it then. Yeah, I find I I'm knackered as well by this stage. It's hard to kind some I'm nearly more too tired to be terrified of what people would say. Do you know that way? Uh, but when you see when you see the positive reactions like that, it just I, I'd be sitting at home when I'm watching it. I just can't stop smiling when I see the people coming in and having such a you know emotionally happy feeling to it. You know, it's brilliant. It's life changing. Makes it all worthwhile. It is life changing. Yeah, it is life changing. It is life changing. But it is nice as well to do it with such. I, I, the other thing I love is the fact that it's not massive budget massive money that it's like yeah it's, you know what i mean it's just a design when it's really good i speak is it, that it's tiny well, well, I, like the detail. i think as well though we make a huge difference to those houses where you could go to someone who has a big house and a big budget and is it really going to change their lifestyle probably not but when no. we go in and we do what we do here the decluttering the redesign the new work everything is something that they can take with them for the rest of their lives and, and it, yeah. like it has a huge impact on their lives whereas i think that's bigger said, budgets it wouldn't have it that said i would love for the crack to one one big budget one with you for the crack like yeah one, one big budget in in a series would be good yeah it would be, it would be good just our big space i do just for the crack one day but i suppose i don't know if you feel it's good would you get it done in three days Hello? that's not a big budget thing we're talking like a, a room nah. to one, a big house. Oh, come here, will you stop? Don't enough of those. My, my, I, I have to I have to leave that part of my life behind. <laughs> Move forward, Roshan. I suppose I haven't done a big, I haven't, I like small space as well. Oh, look, it's gorgeous. Look at that. Wow. She wasn't expecting it, to see. I think she just thought it was a. Well, you were. You were no, we weren't I meant to do that room. This is where we have to tie Jane up as well. We go, okay, Jane, should put Jane in the room going, just a three rooms, not two rooms. Yeah. <laughs> That's what, so we get told at start, it's two rooms. It's supposed yeah. to be two rooms. You've only three days to do it. Yeah. I don't think we've done one job or we haven't gone into the third room. We're all no. Shame. no. And to be fair to you, it's really only two days of work, building work, because we're yeah, well, yeah, well, after. Yeah, and we don't get there until the decluttering is done and then we leave before the reveal is done so you know it's it's fairly hectic that looks great though doesn't it well i do i think it's a bit of a miracle job see the distance there though that's what i should a lot of goodwill from their family friends neighbors yeah. and the clutter busters like because after they've decluttered, yeah. put everything back, they then come in to help to all the, the flat pack, all the, and also a little bit of the kind of when you're, I'm having a very stressful time sometimes at this stage, going, does it look desperate? Does it look, somebody will say, go for it, like, go on, keep going. You're halfway, they, they encourage you to be wild yeah. as well, not to be too scared. Look at all those people, it That's is. A great there. team, great team effort. Great Look team. at it. Yeah, it's all a big team effort. Look at it. everyone involved, great.
Yeah, good stuff. It's great. It's great watching them back, isn't it? Because I think when you're when you're in the in the moment, it's uh, it can be a bit hectic, and you you can sometimes you don't appreciate it because you've been there for the two or three days. But when you get to look back, and again, I say it, like when you can see the reactions of the people, it really does make it worthwhile. Well, you know, it's great. It's a very honest show, isn't it? That's what I like about it as well. Because it's show. a lot of honesty to let someone into your house. Let's say that again, Roger. Never get too honest. <laughs> Liar, we have to enjoy that yeah. guys. Yeah. Uh, it was great. Thank yeah, you very much. Cool. Thanks very much, yeah. And actually, it is a bit of a little miracle every one, isn't it? Every time we uh, do yeah. a miracle. I don't know how we do it. Yeah, well, we're, we're very lucky for you guys, and we're very lucky the the participants that apply. They're they're super people, um, and thank Absolutely. you and and the both of you and the clutter busters and the builders and the painters and everyone involved, because it really is a team effort. So well done, guys. It was just a group positive in all ways, and you know, in the tough times that we have now, we need the same thing. We need everybody coming together and trying to do the right thing. So stay safe, everybody, and hopefully we'll get back to doing our, our, our builds and hopefully get back to normality in this country and all around the world as soon as we possibly can, please God. Yeah. Let the force be with us. <laughs>